Hello everybody. The strength and beauty of dovetails are inherent. Unfortunately, some of us are intimidated by dovetails because we hear that it is hard to cut or difficult to measure. But don't we always tell our sons and daughters that nothing worthwhile is ever going to be easy? The average American watches about 34 hours of TV a week and spends about 23 hours a week online. If we watched one less hour of some documentary about the New Jersey shoreline or spent 30 less minutes watching some unimaginative how-to video, that gives us 78 hours a year to challenge ourselves. And why not make that challenge a dovetail joint? To help us meet the challenge, I'm going to show you how to make this dovetail template. It is nearly identical to the one used by Paul Sellers, but to make this requires none of Paul Sellers' hand sawing skills. My template is made from two pieces of quarter inch thick oak and three cuts on the miter saw. So let's get started. There are a few consumables used to make this template. One is um, some a thin board. This is left over from an old project. It's a about a quarter inch thick and an inch and a half wide. Some glue. A little piece of dowel rod. This is uh, about a quarter inch thick. And double sided tape. This tape is left over from a window insulation. Be sure to understand the inherent risks of your projects and wear the proper safety equipment and take the proper safety precautions. And the most important safety equipment are these safety goggles. I placed double sided tape onto this piece of board. I'm actually going to use the fence on my miter saw to help me align these two so that they fit in together perfectly. And then I'm going to take this tape off and slowly ease this up, make sure that this top is nice and flush. This feels pretty flat. At the one end, I've made two marks. The distance between these two marks is about one and a half inches. And this is approximately the eight degree lines that I'm going to cut. I've secured the pork piece into the miter saw. And the saw has been set to eight degrees. If you're off by a degree or two, it doesn't really matter. So I'm ready to make my first cut. Don't forget these and these. So I'm ready to make this second cut here. The miter saw is now set to 90 degrees. For my final cut, I'm going to cut a piece here that's approximately 6 inches long. I'm going to use the miter saw staging area to help me align these. I've made a little mark of where I would like the top of these to align. When you're gluing, if you're a little off this way or this way, it's okay. As long as either the top side or the bottom side is nice and flush. I've placed double sided tape onto one of the pieces. I'm going to secure this against the back.
going to remove the excess glue with my chisel here. Dovetail template is now functional. I hope you will join me for part 2 of 2 where we check the alignment and apply the finishing touches.